hair by this grace. In this video, I want to talk about some women that I have known, you know, this type of woman over the years, uh, worked with them, or even when I was young, you know, went to school with them. And basically, now that they're adults, they have not grown up. And they're not the same women that I grew, you know, grew up with, but just women around my age now. I'm not uh, trying to pick on women, you know, like me, uh, or around my age, or women at all. It's just this, this video is going to be about the women, and I'll do videos about men some other time. But um, anyway, I thought I'd get out today. It's such a beautiful, well, it's not really a beautiful day, but at least it's warm up to 70 right now, 7-0. And after all four months now, a little more than four months of just cold, you know, weather, not the type that you just don't want to go out in which is very unusual here in Texas. It's like, we may, I used to say we had one day of winter. You know, we had two seasons, summer and one day of winter. And so far we've had four months of uh, winter. No, no autumn, as usual. Anyway, so I'll get to talking about I'll get to talking about that. I was watching a TV show where the guy was from Texas and, oh my goodness. Yeah, it made me start talking like they, they think Texas talk there and said okay what do you mean talk like or is it speak like <laughs> oh my goodness but anyway about these women now when I was young I had to really think about this but when I was like a kid in school you know they had some girls you know I was a girl young girl you know there were some other ones that would be mean but you would usually just have like one you know I remember for years I would say you know how it is you know you always have that one person, I would call them that one, and it could be male or female, in a class, not really mean, just that one person who's going to stand out in a classroom or whatever. And it was always that one. Well, as time's gone, time has gone by, it's more than just one usually these days. But anyway, about the mean girls, um, I don't know how old I was, probably maybe in my 30s when somebody said that they called those mean girls, you know, it was women. Uh, I don't like calling women girls, so, you know, I, I really hadn't heard anybody call it mean girls. I don't know. Maybe I lived in a uh, bubble or something, but, yeah, we never said mean girls. So, maybe it's just a thing here, you know. I just don't call gr uh, women girls. Like if somebody calls me a girl, you know. Seriously, it's been a long time since I've been a girl. I'm 55, so, no. But anyway, that's kind of a long intro <laughs> to talk about, have you have you experienced this? Now, I remember there was a time, I don't know how old it was then, uh, but I was working and I remember saying that usually it's the women who were in their 30s, uh, you know, maybe up to 35, you know, 30 to 35, who did this. They were just, you know, like you're working on, you know, in an office kind of environment where there were enough people that... Um, you know, there could be a little group of women, and they were just mean to everybody. They would gossip, they were mean, rude, hateful, um, cause you problems, and not, you know, it wasn't everybody in the office, it was just a always a group, and there was always that leader, um, you know, like a narcissist, and these days they say the narcissist was the leader, and the other ones were the flying monkeys, not from the Wizard of Oz, but yeah, you know, I've seen that. And I remember, like, that would say over 20 years ago, um, that I had seen it, and I always thought that it was just the women around that age. Well, or apparently I was wrong. You know, I don't know what age I was at that time, like I said. But yeah, now that I'm 55, as I've gotten older, gone, gone through 35 to 55 here, I've seen them. They, they don't stop. They don't age out of that. They don't grow up, basically. And it's, like I said, it's not the same women from then till now. But anyway, you know, and they're not always the women my age, but quite often they are. Women around my age. Now, I have a video, I don't know if I put it on before this one or after this one, about how, you know, you don't always, you're not always around people your age when you're at work, you know. But I don't know if I'll put it, like I said, before this one or after this one. But anyway, yeah. 
you know, and the stuff that they would do, really, I mean, come on, you know, when you're in, even when you're in school, there shouldn't be any bullying, and this is, you know, what these women do then, probably did then, and they do it now, it's just picking on somebody, they think it's fun, it's funny, it's just it's something to lighten, you know, lighten up, not lighten up, but, um, you know, make the day more dramatic, make the day feel much better for them. To pick on somebody, to cause a drama. Seriously, some women actually think that way. Even in their 50s and up, they just get a thrill out of causing drama, you know, causing problems for somebody. You know, saying awful things about them, and even down to just the way that they, you know, the other woman, whatever woman or women, you know, about how they dress or how they wear their hair or uh, what what they do with their makeup. Somebody just made a comment. I'll let her shout herself out. But, yeah, about somebody picking on her about her makeup. You know, just anything. Just to, you know what? You know, really, I mean, I'm not laughing at it. I'm, I'm, I really do know how I see why they're doing this. Channel that I do on, you know, basically abusive behavior, and a whole separate channel. I'm not using it right now, but so I do have a clue. <clears throat> but it's just such a sad thing to see, you know, it's that somebody actually thinks it's fun to hurt and harm. It's a, you know, a one woman feels it's okay and fun, and there's their flock that you know people, people, uh, people, both male and female. <clears throat> flock around that type because they get a kick out of hearing the stories. They get a kick out of hearing, you know, people like that, women like that, talk bad about other women. It's sickening, seriously. Okay, and I can tell you that this is the type who would say, well, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, man, I'm telling you, seriously. I know this type. I have known this type since I was a kid, okay? They always say it's, you know, they always say it's you who's doing it. You're doing it too. It's okay if you do it too. You know, you can't say anything. They'll always find some way to twist it that way. Instead, I'm just pointing out this is the type of women I have seen. Yeah, and this, this stuff needs to stop, really. A squirrel moment, but I must have picked the worst time to go to a grocery store. I've never seen it this busy. On a Sunday at 3.11. Must be some game or something about to play. I'm not one who watches games, so I really wouldn't know. Yeah. Anyway, about this type of women, I see it far too much, especially the past, I don't know, well, actually, the whole time I've been on YouTube. And then there's always, always been, and I keep wanting to practically forget it, forget that there have been this type. But no, there's been this type since I've been on YouTube while I was watching YouTube channel for say uh say it's all together it's probably been like five years but I, on my original channel the first video i made was probably four and a half years ago and it's like that's when it started that's when i started seeing them come out of the woodwork you know it's especially the steal your ideas type you know the, the, apparently they're not that smart that's how i see them i see them as they're not that smart so they steal other people's ideas and they yeah the type, they are also usually the type to then, I'm trying to put my shoe on here, then, then what they do is uh, they steal your ideas and then they try to play the victim or and or they go around telling people behind your back that you've said this and that and whatever or they might even try to say you did it first. You know, something along that line. Now, if you're on YouTube, there are more. there's more than one way to, to show people when you published your video and then have that other person they're going to say you you stole their ideas say prove it i can show when i made mine <laughs> date and time okay uploaded and published so uh, but it's sad that you have you know a life where this kind of person and fe these are females men do this kind of, same kind of stuff believe me men do the same kind of stuff that that was the latest for me to deal with was a man doing this stealing my ideas and they'll big, big time. But yeah, you know, and then then they'll turn around and, like I said, do one of those things. They turn it back around on you somehow, 
or they play the victim, they, they say you did it, whatever they're going to do, they're going to play some game. That is the biggest thing I've seen that these women do. Besides the, the, the whole thing of bashing another woman, you know, saying awful things about her. Grow up, people, really, seriously, grow up. You know, have some dignity, even, you know, class, something. Not this, this, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up and go into the store. I don't know if I'm going to put a um, visual effect on this one, effect on this one or not. It's kind of cloudy. Um, but usually I, I like to, so we'll see, you know. Anyway, I'll wrap it up. If you want to subscribe to this channel and you haven't already, click the circle. Oh, and by the way, I do have some some of those videos I've made about this topic. I have them on private. I put a bunch of my videos on private. And, ooh, sounds like thunder. And I'm going to rearrange them, you know, do different things. You know, maybe release one at a time again. But I'm going to put them in a playlist. And anyway, I had gone on a little vacation. I thought I was going to be longer away from YouTube. So I put all my videos, old ones. And more than one reason, really. I put them on private. I'm going to start making them public one by one. Maybe just one by one. We'll see. Boy, that didn't make any sense. <laughs> I need to get out because starting to worry me. Was that thunder? Uh, yeah, you know it usually comes with thunder, right? Okay, wrapping up. Like I said, if you want to subscribe and you haven't already, click the circle. If you want to watch another video on this channel, click one of the rectangles. Like, subscribe, comment, and share if you would. And I'll talk to you on another video. Bye.